Today I'm showing you the watercoloring with the classic Stampin' Up! stamp pad and an aqua painter. The aqua painters come with two brushes, one brush tip there and a smaller brush tip. I'm going to use the smaller brush tip, so I'll set this other one aside. I'm also going to use the Stampin' Up! die regular size pads and I'll need to get a little bit of ink on the top other surface of my pad so I squeeze it together open it up and there you'll see I have a pool of ink. To get started I'm using one of the images from the Pun Fun set and I'm using the Stays On Permanent Solvent Ink. I'm using the Stays On because it will not run when I use my water over it. Stamp my image and then with my aqua painter, I can squeeze right in the center here to get a little bit of water. You don't want to squeeze too much. If you get too much water, you'll get too much pooled onto your ink pad. And then just pick up some of the color and start painting. Now I am using the Whisper White. If you do use the uh, watercolor paper, you'll get a different look and a, a little different way about watercoloring. But I often use just the Whisper White. So you keep watercoloring around. I usually start on my edges and then pull the color towards the middle. Get my bird done. I'm using brocade blue with him today. So let's see, I'm gonna try and the watercolor paper you can get this little extra darker areas kind of smoothed out a bit better. The nice thing about the aqua painter is you just wipe it on your scratch paper when you want to switch colors. So I'm going to switch to the So Saffron, and with the So Saffron, I'll go in and do his tummy. Nice thing about the Aqua Painter is also that you don't have to replace any type of fluid or anything. It's just water in the barrel. It opens up, and you just use regular water. Now I'm going to switch to Real Red for the hat. Grab a little more ink off of my pad, go in, and color his hat. And when you're done, just wipe it off. Even if there's a little bit of staining on the tip, it'll still work fine the next time. So that's my little bird. And then this is a super simple little 3x3 three three note card for you as a finished up project. I hope you enjoyed watercoloring with aqua painters.